Woods versus Terrence Crawford is supposed to be set for June 17th. What do I think about that? And also what I think about Terrence Crawford's message saying, April Fools. Well, first off, as far as the April Fools comment that Terrence Crawford tweeted, what does that mean? Well, it can mean absolutely nothing, right? To, to the butt haters. Maybe he typed it because, well, you know, um, maybe it's April Fool's time. Could that have been something? You know, April Fool's? But why would he say that, Rebel? I don't know. You got to find out. Ask him. Maybe he's saying all you spend supporters are fools. I don't know. <laughs> But all signs are pointing towards that fight being a thing. Maybe finally. Lexus Rocha decided to fight somebody else. He's not fighting in May anymore. He's supposed to fight Terrence Crawford. That was supposed to be his opponent. But um, apparently, Lexus Rocha has moved on and he is fighting. Uh, I don't remember the name of the guy he's fighting. Actually, he's fighting somebody else. That's all. I don't know his name. I mean, he's not really that important. So that might mean that there is a possibility that, that there is an Errol Spence versus Terrence Crawford on the horizon for June. That would be nice because that's actually my daughter's birthday, June 17th. Now, there are channels that are doubting this. And I'm going to be real with y'all. I'm going to be all the way 100. Some channels that I don't really fuck with a lot of these dudes, but they make perfect sense. We heard it before. They give us a date, and then it don't be a date. And then it be some other shit. They, oh, it's supposed to happen this date, and then it don't happen. And then, oh, it's happening November 19th, and then it don't happen. And then, oh, it's happening um, January, and then it don't happen January. Better off, like a certain channel said, was like, yo, you better off just saying it's going to happen sometime this year. Stop giving definite dates. And I agree 1,000%. Stop giving definite dates if you're not sure. And you know another thing that's strange, too? How come I didn't hear Terrence Crawford say the fight is happening June 17th? Um, how come I didn't hear Errol Spence say it? They're talking about they're going to announce it on the Ryan Garcia versus Javante Davis fight. Why? Why would you wait till two weeks from now to do that? What's the point? What's the damn point of doing that? I'm going to say this, man. Do I believe the fight is happening? I don't know. It might be. It, it, it looked like um, you, you didn't hear really much about any any more negotiations. Usually, sometimes we don't really hear much. That could be a pos a sign of positivity. That that a positive sign that this thing is a real deal. It's the real deal this time. Or it could just mean more cryptic bullshit. We just gonna have to find out. We will see uh, what happens. Listen, when Ryan Garcia fights Tank, and you don't hear no words from nobody or no announcement. That fight ain't gonna happen June 17th. It was just another uh, thing to keep these two dudes buzzing or something. I don't even know no more, bro, to be honest. Why they would even bring up, what does Ryan and Tank got to do with anything? Them, them dudes is freaking lightweights, man. Why do you need them to, 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 to announce a fight? Don't that sound a little strange to you? You need uh, smaller weight classes, and you dudes are more popular. You dudes are at a more prestigious weight class and you need you need Tank and Ryan's card to to announce a fight? Mmm. Seem kind of weird to me, huh? Anyway, you already know who it is. It's your boy Rebel Life Boxing. Let me know what y'all think. Drop a comment. Like all that hot shit. Sub to your boy. I'll catch y'all later on the next one. And I'm out.